Easter Sunday school, please talk to us in Jesus' name. I pray. Amen. What was sown on the good soil, he who hears the word, understand it, bears fruit, yields, in one case hundred folds, in, in another sixty, and in another thirty. Matthew 13, 23. Praise the Lord, dear children. Welcome to Online Sunday School. Hope you are all good. Dear children, did you remember what was our last Bible lesson? I spoke about beware of what you talk. The way you talk really matters. Right dear children? Today I am going to tell about the sower and the seed which is in the gospel according to the Matthew chapter 13. Here we can see four types of lands. When Jesus was explaining to his disciples, he was giving detailed explanation about what is the seed and what is the land. Here the seed represents the word of God and the land represents our heart. Dear children, I am going to take an example for each and every land. The first land represents the people who hear the word of God, but they won't understand. They won't remember what they have heard. Because Satan will come, up, come and take over their word of God from them. I'll take one example. Let us think, a small boy, a small child, he came to the Sunday school for the first time. Okay, he came to the Sunday school and he was involved in everything, but... Soon after, he went to home. He did not remember anything. He just came, but he didn't give ear to what he has heard. That was the first land. Okay, 
Now comes the second land. In the second land, the people will hear the word. They'll take it joyfully and they will end. They will endure for some time. But when tests and trials come to stand for the Lord, they will wither away. They'll fall. I'll take an example. A Sunday school child. He came to the Sunday school. He enjoyed all the activity. He heard the story too. For few weeks, he was regular to the Sunday school. But after few weeks, he thought that oh, it's very long from my home. Due to small small reason, he was not able to come. These people will soon fall. Okay, dear children. And coming to the third land, the people. will hear the word of god but the worldly pleasures will choke them it does not make them to stand for the lord i'll take an example as for the sunday school child a child is coming to the sunday school he is regular but the time comes where in his home there was a big function and in his home at the time we can think that there was a cricket match there was a most important cartoon he doesn't want to miss that one due to that reasons he won't be coming to the sunday school did you see children all the three lands all the three children which i have spoke about one he just came and he went away the second one for the silly reasons that it is very far he didn't come to the god's presence and the third one because he has match he has some functions he did not come and he did not hear the word of god but now comes the fourth land the land where the people hear the word of god they will understand the word of god that they, they will bear the fruit and yield to 30 60 and 100 folds these children whatever may happen they will be regular to the sunday school they won't leave the uh, they won't leave the word of god they won't leave god for such a silly reasons oh i have this work i have that work they won't stop coming to the presence of god dear children our god our jesus want us to be like that we need to hear the word of god we should understand it we should live for the god we should bear the fruit as well as he and we should yield it up to 30 folds up to 60 folds up to 100 folds so dear children what is your situation are you living the sunday school do you want to be in the fourth land or else is your condition is in these three lands just think hope you have enjoyed the bible lesson next week we will meet with another bible lesson until then bye dear children wait we have we are going to see an activity based upon this lesson hello friends welcome to star for jesus today i am giving you a practical illustration of the sower and the seed there are four kinds of lands the first land i am taking for the first land i am taking a ice cube which represents the word of god and a flame i am keeping this ice cube on the flame did you see friends the ice is melting fastly See friends there is no ice now it means that when we hear the word of god satan comes and take the words from us and we can't understand or remember the word of god for the second land i am again taking the ice cube which represents the word of god and is and this ball of water which represents the test and trials friends i am keeping this ice in this water and this ice is also melting fastly it means that to some people hear the word of god with joy receive it with joy but when the test and trials come they will fall down because there is sin in their heart now comes the third land i'm taking this ice cube 
which also represents the word of god and the atmosphere which represents the worldly pleasures friends i am keeping this ice cube on this plate friends you can see this ice is melting slowly this is not fast as earlier but it's melting dear friends we can see here the ice is melted so it means that when people hear the word of god and have endure pain but when they are attracted to worldly pleasures it will choke the word of god friends now comes the fourth one friends i have taken a bowl of ice which represents the holy spirit now i am taking this ice cube which represents the word of god and i am keeping on this ball of ice the ice cube is not at all melting my friends this ice cube is fixed to it it's not melting and it is fixed to the ball of ice it means that friends when people hear the word of god through the holy spirit they will understand the word of god they will bear fruits so friends when we hear the word of god through the holy spirit then we will understand the word of god we will bear fruits hope you enjoyed our activity next week we'll meet with a new activity until then bye bye jesus thank you for this day jesus thank you for helping us to talk talk through the sunday school thank you jesus help us to hear your hear your word with through the holy spirit please jesus in jesus name i pray amen